By 1980, BMX racing had evolved and expanded into a cruiser class, implementing larger size 24 and 26 inch bikes for riders that needed something bigger than the standard 20 inch BMX bike. BMX products answered with their own cruiser model for Jeff Kazmala, and they called it the Kaz Cruiser. I mean, the cruiser class was really picking up momentum, and this was like in the mid-79s and stuff like, you know, 79. And our team manager, we were one of the only teams that had an official team manager, trainer. Um, his name was Cliff Halsey. He showed up at this race with his bike, and he goes, hey, we want you to ride this bike, and it's a cruiser. And, of course, I was the biggest guy on the team, and I wasn't really too interested in it. And he's like, come on, Jeff, go give it a shot and see what you think. So I'm like, okay. So I went out and practiced it, and it was like it was like driving a semi truck. I mean, it was just big and bulky, and I'm like, wow, this is this is pretty big compared to a 20 inch. But um, I said, okay, fine, I'll race it. I'll, I'll give it a shot. Sign me up. And uh, Sunday it came down to when people were really starting to pay attention because the leader of the pack in that class was Scott Breithaupt for a long time, and uh, you know he was winning everything. And here's this guy that comes out with this bike that never raced it before you know, giving him a run for his money. And the main, uh, I was leading, Scott put me over in one of the corners, you know, kind of dove inside of me, which was fine, no big deal, that's racing. And uh, I made it a point where I was gonna catch him. And I'll never forget coming around the last corner in the back of his pants saying, see ya on there. And that was his kind of little trademark thing. And going down the last straightaway, I just hit the turbocharger and I passed him going to the finish line and that was it, I was hooked, I was done. The whole next couple of weeks was back into the shop redesigning this big massive bike that they had trying to get a little bit smaller <laughs> and then that was it that was the beginning of it you go to the track and if somebody pulled up in the cruiser class and they weren't sponsored by a particular company when they were just the bike shop or something like that they rode a mongoose cause cruiser 